Welcome to Everything's on Fire. This looks awesome. So we've got the mixtape mode, which is part of the um, the the uh, DLC thing. I think it's part of the deluxe edition. So yeah, this is my choices. Don't forget, I attacked that asshole. Uh, I was mean to Joyce. Sorry, Joyce. I had to tell you what what it is. I defended Nathan, and I told Rachel we were more than just friends. It's a brave new world. Oh, they swap shirts in this one, or jackets. Brave new world. So the new one, new episode comes out in in nine days. Got to get this all out of the way. Previously on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. Oh, that 30 FPS fire shitting itself. Punk, some manners. Hey, dickhead. Get the fuck out of here. Are they going to show my, uh, your my costumes? My nope, rules. obviously not. I see you slipping. These are all pre-rendered. We don't have to like each other. But you will respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Fuck off, David. Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe. If one day I'm just out of here, let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. Jeez. Do you remember that guy that we saw? I remember that. Tree with that woman. That was my dad. And now we, and, and we caused a big push fire. Was definitely not my mom. Okay, this is still, still vandalism. Quite, quite bad vandalism. Ah, in the principal's office. Right. Are we in trouble? Miss Price, how good of you to join us. I haven't changed since yesterday. I'm so sorry we're yesterday. late. My, my shift ran late at the diner and then... Just... Sorry. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. Can I please make And the me... other is Never all mind. too familiar with it. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. Okay. When that respect okay. is violated... Reality check time. I can't shit talk Yesterday my way through this. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Probably uh, not. What? I knew it. Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? Uh, is that rhetorical? Snark! Are you asking, or is that rhetorical? Disrespectfulness. <laughs> you met me? We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. Yeah, that was never going to happen. We did. In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. Despite all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Oh, fuck that. Disregarding posted signs about trespassing on the stage. Okay. And? Confirmation of drug use. What? Allegedly. I didn't see any witnesses. This is not a trial, Miss Price. This is a sentencing. Shall I continue? Oh, do, please. Attempting to sabotage the academic goals of one of our top students. What? 
Victoria Chase. Oh, right. I told her. I told her the chemistry. I told her, fuck you. She cheated. Academic goals like doing her own homework? Because I thought Blackwell had a zero tolerance policy on plagiarism. Excellent suggestion. Stricter punishment for students who violate Blackwell's code of conduct is next on our agenda. Oh. For more her shit. plagiarism, Miss Chase might have been suspended. Chloe, you tried to get someone suspended? Might have. If Mr. Prescott, Nathan Prescott, hadn't spoken to me on Victoria's behalf, and we have witnesses saying Miss Price was also involved in a bullying incident of the same Mr. Prescott. <sighs> the hell I was! I stood up for that little weirdo. Yeah, you tell him. I suppose that's one interpretation of events. However... Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. Oh, fuck that. You... Uh, wait, what? Why is it A and D? Reass wait, what happened to my controller? Hello, game? There we go. Uh, I am going to reish. No, I'm going to calm him. Principal Wells, I know this looks bad. Thank you for your validation, Miss Price. May I continue? With your permission? Wow, you are a piece of shit, aren't you? Sorry. And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. What does that mean? It means... You forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... I made her do it. What? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. <laughs> I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? For... For what? <laughs> for what? You didn't do anything. Your willingness to stand by me, even now, is truly inspiring. That sounds horribly forced. Chloe, is this true? It's true. It's damn true. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. Oh, Wells looks so butthurt. Miss Price. What? Yeah, fine. Fine, yes. It was her idea. But it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. Miss Amber, based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Ray! Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you, or... Trick her? Yes, I'm sure. Oh, thank God. Mrs. Price, this revelation may color the situation some, but it in no way absolves your daughter. Man, the circle jug I around Blackwell is Mr. terrible. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under... I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of The Tempest. No.
uh, the performance is... T no, call him out. He's nuts. What? Are you insane? Your discipline is still pending, Miss Price. Ray, she loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Don't you Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. That lady also definitely wasn't uh, Rachel's mom. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances, accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. Of how course. Fitting. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. Oh, that. That f is. Such what was that, Miss Price? <sighs> Chloe is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next, unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Is it going to be a story choice? No, I'm going to take the blame. No way is Rachel missing the play for me. But thanks to her acting skills, I'll have to go down in flames if I want to fix this. Uh, okay, so here's my reasoning behind this. It's cause we all know that Chloe in uh, Life is Strange has already fucked her academics. So why not take it all the way, right? Get your head out of your ass, Wells. Chloe, <laughs> you seriously think yesterday was a little Miss Sunshine's idea? Miss Amber has accepted her responsibility. Accept reality. Don't you have the slightest idea how this works? You don't wake up one morning and decide to be an outlaw. You need priors. You need training. Rachel confessed. Are you calling her a liar? I'm calling her a... I confess she can act. I confess to thinking she can act like a motherfucker. You just bought her crap. Hook, line, and sinker. You don't have to do this. It's okay. Really. Shut up, Rachel. You do you. How about you don't take credit for my shit? You don't see me claiming I did my homework, do you? Because that's your stupid thing. Chloe, this can't be you. Apologize this instant. Shouldn't have dragged Rachel into it. Fine. Shit. I shouldn't have pulled Rachel shit. out of class. Shit, that's not right. If I'd known she couldn't handle it, I would have gone it alone. Why speak up, Miss Price? Your words do not exonerate Rachel, but they do further implicate you. Why not tell the truth? Why? Yes, thank God. To tell the truth, for once. Something that happens so rarely around here. Everybody lies. I've heard enough. Rachel, you were clearly trying to cover for your classmate. I appreciate the motive, but I appreciate honesty more. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You will not be removed from the play. Oh, thank God. Was that so hard? Thank you. And Miss Price, I came into today's meeting planning to suspend you for the rest of the school year. Tuh. With a chance for reinstatement in the fall. I'm going to get expelled now. now. You are expelled. I fucking knew it. Okay. What? No. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. Come on, Chloe. I thought there was gonna be an option for like last last bit of defiance, just flip him off as you walk out. Oh shit. I'm sorry. Nothing to be sorry about. Meet me at the junkyard later? You bet. I kinda thought that Rachel was I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, uh. I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. 
We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Hey, Skip. You're cool. Mom, I'm I'll see you in the parking lot. Okay. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me. Hey, Skip. Fuck them. Bunch of fascists. Oh, you know it. Hey, uh... Just wanted to say... It sucks what is happening to you. Thanks, Skip. You're gonna be missed. Thank you, Skip. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Uh, photo. Dad got Bongo from the rescue shelter. Then he got run over by a car. Moral of the story, no one's ever really rescued. He said Bongo got hit by a car. I'm gonna take the picture of Bongo. Uh, homework. Love how every time someone tells me how much potential I have, it's right before saying how I'm wasting it all. Uh, Chloe, your prize, chem lab F. I need to start seeing more effort in you or you're going to fail my class. The quality of your work, uh, quality of your work lately simply doesn't speak to the amount of potential I see in you. I know you are better than this. <laughs> Fuck that. Ah, Skip's a good dude. He's gonna wait. Trusty keeper of my graffiti pens. You've served me well. Wonder who will grace this space after me. Sign. Almost. <laughs> she lasted a year. I had big plans for adding to this collage. Oh well. Anarchy. High whale. Fuck. Expelled. It's starting to feel real. A chemistry book. Having Justin as my locker neighbor was... One of maybe chem was the class I hated the least. Eh, we can take the chem book, I guess. Or not. Hmm. If Chloe leaves Blackwell at 11 a.m., going 100 miles per hour, how long will it take her to get as far away as fucking possible? Uh, depends on how long it's fucking far away as possible. I'm gonna say an hour. 100 miles is very far away. Skip is like, what the fuck, Chloe? I should write a poem to mark the occasion. Something with... <laughs> imagery. Bunch of middle fingers. A lot of them. Absolutely. Positively the best concert of 2008. Too bad it's time to go. Battle! Retrieve. Finally. What I actually came here for. How do you... What is... Uh, uh, Jackpot. Jackpot. Wait. What the hell? Damn it, Justin. Mmm. Uh, ah, oh, god damn it, Justin. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me. Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? A 
Haha. <laughs> Time to vandalize the shit out of this place. Oh my god. I want Chloe to be the one to draw the um, the glasses and the crown on the last door. Wow, that is very impressive. doing this for insubordinate oh this is this is Chloe's own like photo wall Fucked. 